What is up YouTube? Welcome back to another Escape from Tarkov video. I'm Khan and today I'm going to show you guys something that I used to do a lot when I first started Tarkov to get some free guns and some free rubles. This is also something that I do every single early wipe. So when the wipe happens, I'm going to be totally doing this all the time. It's a really, really good tactic and it makes it a little less harsh when you die. So as always, I stream on Twitch. Link is down below. You can always subscribe and like if you like the content and I have a giveaway going on right now so once i hit 5,000 subscribers on youtube i'm going to be giving away an edge of darkness account to one of you guys so a full access edge of darkness account to one of you guys but in order to enter that giveaway you have to subscribe to my youtube channel and be following my twitch because i will be doing the live uh giveaway over on twitch let's get into the video without further ado Alrighty, so here are my stash, and what I want to show you guys is this slot right here. So the scabbard. So I have my red rebel in there right now, but we're going to take that off. So when I first get into a wipe, I always leave my scabbard empty. They give you those cat uh, hatchets um, to start with, and I always take that off. Now the reason being is when you die, your scabbard is like your kappa or your gamma container. You don't actually lose what's in the scabbard. So if you pick up a knife or a axe or something like that on your PMC, you don't lose it when you die. So what I do is when I go into raids, and these are really easy to find, I pick up these knives. Now if you pick up these knives, there are some barters that you can do at level 1 two peacekeeper that will get you some free guns and the reason why I say free is because all you gotta do kill a scav or find a dead scav these are always on scavs pick up the knife throw it on your scabbard and if you die you still keep that knife so for these brown knives you need eight of them and for these black knives you need four I prefer to pick up the brown knives over the black ones and I'll show you why in a second but if you can find these brown knives I definitely recommend picking them up finding antique axes is also a little bit more rare but they sell for 50,000 rubles to Jaeger. so if you do find an axe I would take that over all of this stuff but at the end of the day these brown knives are really useful and I will show you why so let's head over to my traders and we're gonna go to peacekeeper level one now peacekeeper level one he has a couple barters that you can do so for this p226 r pistol which is a nine millimeter pistol that you can use for money runs or just use in a little raid early wipe or if you guys are really struggling like i said throw one of these on with some level four armor and go do some stash runs money runs down below by the way so i got lots of videos of those and uh these are only four black knives so we can trade for one of these and we get a free pistol that it's basically free then this is what i pick up the brown knives for you get an mp5 now you can do one of these per restock so you got to kind of pace them out but if you just stack up knives you're basically every couple hours you get a free mp5 which is a nine millimeter gun and it's pretty decent early wipe has barely any recoil vertical recoil only 48 with zero mods and that's only eight knives so we'll trade for that. Now, if you guys aren't having a hard time finding guns, and you have a lot of guns, but you're cash poor, you can always go to Mechanic and sell these guns back to Mechanic. So me personally, I don't really need an MP5 at the moment. I have a decent amount of money. Um, and I just don't use MP5s later on in the wipe. But early in the wipe, they're definitely usable, and I would definitely use it. But right now, I can just sell it. And for those knives, it's a 332K. So that 32,000 over just stacking those knives up throughout your gameplay in Tarkov will definitely build up and definitely help you. Or, you know, use them in a raid and go and get some money. Thank you guys for stopping by. I always bring you guys as many tips and tricks videos as I can. Money runs, speculation, all that kind of good stuff. If you like the content, you can always subscribe. And don't forget about the giveaway. And you have to be following my Twitch to get onto the giveaway. I appreciate you all. And peace, people.